Well, a very good evening to you as you join us for tonight's live game. Unfortunately, our weather forecast is somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It will certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces, hoping it will all somehow stay away. But I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. We have already started here. Auxerre were imperious when the two sides last met. And the fans are asking for more of the same. This is promising. Oh, well played. He needed to get that right. Oh, the ball's come loose. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Uxair, go ahead, one goal to the good. Tries to locate someone up front. Hoists it forward. Auxerre making the ideal start. It is something to build on. What a good start to the game. I think their play has been fast and inventive, and, and this is a fine example of early intent. They've begun as they mean to go on, and another goal is on the cards. Caen were quick to defend their manager in the wake of criticisms levelled at him in recent days. Look, some of the scrutiny is a bit over the top these days, and you're damned if you do and damned if you don't. But he really didn't help himself. His decision making was puzzling to say the least. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. He's left his man. Looks to clip it forward. He's come through and he's had a quick look inside. Hits one! It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Played out to the right. What an adventurous run from a defender. Auxerre are looking pretty solid right now in a period of the game when they have been vulnerable. That's gone a long way up and away. Auxerre are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. There has been just the early goal here and the score is 1-0. And he's there to cut it out. And it's played forward. Drives it towards the front. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. He's got the ball, he's got the space. Loses his balance and loses the ball. And that's been one straight back. Turns and goes back.
Auxerre leading by one and looking very comfortable on it. And out to safety. He's had a shot! A wonderful effort all by himself. Well, the run was really impressive. The finish was depressive and expectations were not met. Forward it goes. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. He's had that put on a plate. Fence has got rid of that. The whistle goes for half time. So there you have it, a close fourth half of football. But it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Uxair leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1 0 at the break. We are already promptly back on the way. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. That intervention was very necessary. Well, that's where he wants it. And it's got through. Gets away from his opponent. Out for a throw. Here it comes. It'll be a throw in. Looks to bypass the midfield. Auxerre really are enduring a, a frustrating spell when it comes to trying to move the ball around the midfield. They, they lack the sharpness and urgency. Jojo. Sorted that out. Gets good distance on it. Oh, what a... He's gone for it! Just off target. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. This is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? It just has to be done. And he's onside. Looking for a decent ball in. Surely... Oh, shooting chance! It's bounced out! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Looking to hit the front line. Oh, well played. He saw that coming. Back to the keeper and try something new. He's made sure that that won't get through. Gets 
on the end and the follow-up. Oh, shame that was nicely worked. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. Kong can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Gets it back. Forward. What does he try from here? Oh, good interception. Away from immediate danger. by no means guaranteed just yet now can he finish chooses to go back that's a corner kick and it's been taken short plays it back Holt goes for goal, it's in! And there's the goal they've been looking for. His position was perfect, the invitation was there for him, and his response absolutely clinical. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Yeah, looks very much like the final nail in the coffin for me, I have to say. Auxerre, oh, once more the kings of the late goal. They do it so often. Just brushed off the ball there. Two minutes to be added on. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And there goes the final whistle. Auxerre come away with the win. A job really well done in all departments. A real some of the parts team effort. Your final 